Hi, my name is Emily and I'm one of the mentors on NextGen. Off, my why I think has changed over time. I think it originally was because my brothers both played and I wanted to follow in their footsteps, but um, as time progressed, I think it kind of turned into just the outlet it provided in life. And um, by that, I mean like once you step on the field, it's up to you how you perform and what attitude you have. Um, so it's nice to forget about problems or just anything and focus on the game and being surrounded by a group of girls that have the same goals and aspirations as you um, is definitely like part of my why just making some of my best friends and learning really valuable life lessons as well. So my pathway has um, been a little bit uh, winding. Um, obviously I started from a young age like I said because of my brothers and then um, this continued because it was something that I really liked and I, I tried everything. I tried gymnastics and dance and all that stuff and um, my mom said she never saw me smile as much as I did on the soccer field. So um, I stuck with it. I played um, through Ali. We made it to OISL. Um, I was with the same team most of my, like, my life um, and we all, or most of us, wanted to get scholarships and um, the team was really good. We all like worked to help each other and then I ended up tearing my ACL um, at a showcase tournament right when most of my other teammates were getting scholarships. So it was really, really devastating and um, I had to get through the recovery and um, I got a scholarship like three months before I had to go report to campus for preseason. So. Definitely a lot of mental toughness, mental strength, and just having a support system in the team uh, made it a lot better. I ended up playing collegiate soccer at Canisius and Buffalo, where I got involved in um, a lot of different clubs and committees and uh, like the student government, the student athlete committee. Uh, I served as a leadership member on my team, so like an assistant captain. And I ended up graduating with like the Presidential Scholar Athlete Award, meaning I did community service, um, academics, and athletics. So. I'm currently now in the process of applying to medical school and a lot of the um, qualities and just personality traits that I have uh, stem directly from playing soccer throughout my childhood and just developing them and um, now hopefully I can kind of pass some of my experiences and um, if some of you do go down a similar path to me, whether it be unfortunately through an injury or wanting to go to the US to get a scholarship, I would love to give you that advice. I would say as a mentor, I'm pretty laid back. Um, I love to talk and I'm pretty outgoing these days. A lot of people are shocked when I say that I used to be shy just because um, how my kind of personality has transformed when I was younger. And like I said, I definitely attribute that to playing sports, but um, I think I'd be a good mentor in terms of letting young athletes know that there's more options than just going professional and that sports can kind of bring you a variety of different, like I said, traits and experiences that will help you later on in life. Um, I think I provide a unique perspective on that, especially with my injury and just being able to empathize with people that may be experiencing that. So um, I'd say as a mentor, I'm just very laid back. I'm a good listener. Um, I will give you my opinion, but also respect obviously what you think and just be there as a sounding board. Sometimes you just need someone to talk to and I just want to be the person that my mentee can feel comfortable with and um, talk to you about anything and everything, soccer or not soccer.